You know, I thought there was something up with Alshon Jeffrey this year, and I simply attribute it to the fact that he had a lack of chemistry between he and Carson Wentz. And while I still feel that's kind of true, now that we know the whole story, my God, according to Ian Rappaport of NFL.com, Alshon Jeffrey was playing through the entire 2017 season with a torn rotator cuff. He had surgery for that today. He played through the whole year with a torn rotator cuff. That's some Greek mythology type shit. We got goddamn Zeus on our team. Somebody check him to see if he's human, because he may not be. So it all makes sense now, because he, he kind of struggled the first seven games. The stats weren't really there, 354 yards, only two touchdowns. He wasn't as strong at the catch point, because normally Alshon Jeffrey turns 50-50 balls into 80-20 balls, but 80-20 balls were just back to being 50-50 balls this year. He's known for his strong hands playing through traffic, and I didn't see as many plays through traffic this year, excluding maybe that fourth and five against Dallas. So it's, it makes sense. The guy was playing with a torn rotator cuff. Unbelievable. That's unreal. He did pick up his play over the final nine games. He had seven touchdowns, 435 yards. And then in the postseason, that's when he played his best football. So tallied 219 yards and three scores. Obviously had that uh, big touchdown in, in the Super Bowl. Had that other touchdown in the NFC Championship game when Foles was sliding to his left late in the first half there. So that's some legendary type stuff. And as if we didn't like this team anymore, this is just unbelievable. So along with all the other guys that are going to be coming back next year off injury, Alshon Jeffrey is going to be stronger and superior than he was this year. Watch out, NFL. The Eagles are coming. There's a new dynasty in town, and it resides in Philadelphia. <laughs>